In problem number six of section 4.1, we're asked to find the nth order partial sums of a fourth degree polynomial uh, centered at x equals one. Now, proposition 4.1.8 says that there's a unique polynomial um, such that if q of x, such that q of x is equal to uh, the sum of coefficients, uh, we'll call them bk, x times x minus a to the power k, where we're summing from k equals uh, 0 to the degree of the polynomial, so 4. And uh, even better than that, we can actually find these coefficients. Uh, they're just equal to the kth derivative evaluated at the center, so evaluated at 1, over k factorial. So the first thing that we'll need to do is find the um, first few derivatives of the polynomial q of x. So q prime of x, that's 4x cubed uh, plus 15x squared minus 6x uh, plus 2. Second derivative is 12x squared plus 30x minus 6. And the third derivative will be 24x plus 30. And finally, the fourth derivative is just equal to 24. So if we, if we evaluate each of these at x equals 1, let's see, the first derivative we get, uh, let's see, here we have 4 plus 2 is 6, minus 6, 0, so we're just, we're just left with 15. Second derivative evaluated at x equals 1 gives us uh, 12 minus 6, so 6 plus 30 is 36. Third derivative gives us 54. And fourth derivative is just constant, so we get 24. So now we say that uh, q of x is equal to, it's equal to this sum, but we know now, know each of the uh, values of uh, b, or each of the coefficients uh, b sub k, so b so 1 is equal to 15, and so on. And the only one that we're missing is just uh, b sub 0, which is equal to uh, just the polynomial itself evaluated at 1. So that's equal to 1 plus 5 minus 3 plus 2 minus 7. And that's equal to minus 2. So now we can write um, the polynomial q of x in this form. So we have minus 2 uh, times x minus 1 to the 0 power, but that's just 1, plus uh, b1, so 15, over uh, 1 factorial, which is just 1, so plus 15 times x minus 1, plus b2, which is 36, divided by 2 factorial, which is 2, so plus 18, times x minus 1 squared. Um, now we have b plus b3, so 54 over uh, 3 factorial, which is 6, so coefficient is 9, 
and uh, we have 9 times x minus 1 cubed. And finally, have uh, 24 divided by 4 factorial, which is uh, equal to 24 times x minus 1 to the fourth. And if we're interested in any of the particular partial sums, we can just take the first um, n terms. So the first partial sum is just minus 2. Second is um, 15, 2 minus 2 plus 15 times x minus 1, and so on, all the way up to the fourth order partial sum.